Let's play Max Payne and escape Roscoe Street Station. Hey, this is the same place we went in, or looks like Alex it. Alex kept me relatively sane for the past three years. Now I didn't know how I felt. Somehow he had stumbled upon something big and ended up stepping on Jack Lupino's toes. Not good toes to be stepping on, I'll tell you what. Lupino ran his racket of sex, drugs, and contract killings from a sleazy hotel in a slum block of tenements. The NYPD was closing in. I could hear the sirens. Their wail was a crescendo. Lupino thought he could get us by taking Alex out and leaving me to take the fall for it. All he had gotten was my attention. I went for the hotel first. It was a sad old thing with flickering lamps and faded colors, cheap mobster punks and tired-eyed prostitutes. I walked straight in, playing at Bogart, like I'd done a hundred times before. The place was run by a couple of murdering mobsters with shark smiles. The Finito Brothers. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the pain in the butt. Painted a max. You're killing me. You make that up yourselves, you get some wine out downstairs to come up with it. Don't answer that. A rhetorical question. I got something for the boss. Lupino around? That kind of depends on who's asking. A friend or a junk squad plan? The don't answer. It's one of them, uh, how do you put it, uh, rhetorical questions. Lupino ain't here, but he says bye. Oh, shit. Lupino wasn't in his cheap hotel. Instead, I ran into the Finito brothers. My cover had been blown. The door slammed shut behind me. And then I was dodging bullets like raindrops. Pain in the butt. Ha <laughs> ha! Pain to the max! Joe Squad Pig, you gotta hit him off the ship! Okay, we're in control now. We get it! And, uh, these guys don't want to go down. However, gunshots will fix that. Just need a bit more than usual. There we go. The Finuto brothers, well, they're. Uh, a letter on the desk caught my eye. I guess eye. you can guess. Oh, hey, more painkillers. And there's someone coming in. Oh! You don't want to rush in so fast. You get shot. Alright, there was a letter on the desk. Something important. I had met Lupino only once. The gangster ran all his rackets through his right-hand man, Vinny Gagnini. Gagnini was a high-strung whiner on the verge of breaking apart, like an overamped Energizer bunny. He had the brains to run the business, but he lacked the balls, always falling short taking his frustration out on underage addicts and call girls. The V deal goes down at your hotel. Jack's exact words. Quote, Vinny, you're in charge of this one. Unquote. Rico Muerte is coming to see you through. Anything goes wrong and everybody's gonna get dead. Goes double for you. Treat this guy real good. Anything he wants, you give him. Don't screw this up for you finito, finitos. A V deal meant added security, locked doors, and lots of nervous thugs with itchy trigger fingers. I'd seen nothing coming in, but that didn't mean it hadn't been there. Rico Muerte was a regular Kaiser Souza, a spook story told to keep the apes in line. Oh crap. 313. The Finitos had scribbled Muerte's room number on the note's margin. These things just keep on getting better. Also, it's snowing outside. All right. I guess we gotta go through the hotel now. Hey, more painkillers. I'm not complaining. And what's this? Oh boy, a vibrating bed. Just what the world needs. In his press conference today, the mayor stated that Valkyr represents a clear danger to New York and called for drastic actions to eliminate the problem. On today's top story, the Valkyr crisis worsens with the murder of DEA Special Agent Alex Balder. Special Agent Balder had been shot repeatedly from a point-blank range. The gunman has been identified as Max Payne. What? 
The noose is sure to tighten around this fugitive criminal, as more NYPD units join the search to apprehend him. I had just gotten my 15 minutes of fame. Oh boy, oh boy. And within half an hour of it happening, we've already been framed for it. Isn't that lovely? Screw the door. I take the window. Yeah, something's wrong with the bosses. Pain's there. Yo. There we go. Hooray for explosive. Whoa. Hooray for almost walking into an explosive. But yeah, something is wrong with the bosses. I killed them a lot. Their lives have been ended prematurely before their time. By me. With bullets. Because that's the way I kill everyone. And we're heading... Wow, that's a good door. High quality. Yo! You can get a shotgun? No. And under one of these beds, there's something. There it is. Oh, shotgun ammo full. Oh well. I don't want to go through that window. Previously, and over here. And ladies. Lady Amelia. What the? I'll give Valentine passes for an audience. Thank you, Lawrence. My lady. My lord. And now, in all whoa, the whoa, whoa. of lords and ladies. Got distracted by the TV. That's not good. Acer Corporation. Okay. After that bit of murder. My lady. My lord. My lady, there is a matter of great importance I must bring to your attention. My lord, there is? Indeed, my lady, there is indeed. From the very first moment we met, upon that distant forest path, there has been sunlight in the autumn leaves blazing like the colors of your hair. Oh, my lord, you should not speak so. But, my lady, I must, I must. My lord, no, I forbid you. This cannot be, this must not be. But why, my love, why? My lord. It is too dreadful. Do not force me to speak the words. My lady, I beg of you, I must know. I would rather die than not know. Yes, my lord, we should both be dead, for this shame is too great for the living. My lord, I am... My lord, I am your long-lost sister. <gasps> and that is one of the many TV shows of Max Payne. They are an interesting little distraction. Oh, hey, there's some Valk here. That's good. Oh, that bed doesn't move. Well, it moves, it just doesn't move to the side. Okay, next time on Let's Play Max Payne, we'll keep on going and try to find this... Oh, I forget his name already. Rico Muerte, that was it. See you then.